The scale can love you or hate you. Trust me, I'm well seasoned and I've seen it and it's also hard as, as us consultant also. Now, the reason sometimes if you're doing the food journal, the food plan, and you're exercising could be your body composition is changing. So don't let the scale mediate your progress. Remember, you're doing this for lifestyle, prevention, quality of life, and feeling good. And always chase the feeling of feeling good because the scale can play tricks on you. It could be stress, it could be flying, it could be the fact that you're driving, it could be the type of sodium in your food, it could be that you're not chewing down your food right, didn't drink enough water, drink too much water, too much caffeine, diuretics, Certain supplements will cause water retention. The humidity here in St. John is a factor every now and then. So there's a slew of factors. So always go and have your own report on how good you feel and how much you're improving. Now you know, engage the scale accordingly.